Through the centuries, there's long been a search for those things that are quintessentially English. And whether that's food, architecture, or even people, it can all be summed up in one word, class. And now for me, the search is over. Just 26 miles from London, Cliveden in Berkshire, originally built in 1666 by the Duke of Buckingham, simply oozes class. And when you bear in mind that two centuries later, the Astor family, who lived here for nearly four generations, entertained such people as George Bernard Shaw, Charlie Chaplin, President Roosevelt, the Queen Mother, the Queen and Princess Margaret when they were children, well, as far as class is concerned, it's obvious that Cliveden is in the Premier League. Someone well known for quintessential Englishness and class is the actress Jenny Agatha, whose husband, incidentally, is a director of the company that manages Cliveden. What does she think of the place? It, uh, it's lovely, but I mean, it is a kind of fantasy. Mm. I, I don't think anyone could possibly really live like this, except um, when you come and visit. But you do. I didn't live here, though. I wish. <laughs> <laughs> as far as the general public's concerned, Cliveden came to prominence during the Perfumer Affair of the 1960s. But according to Jenny, the house was built on scandal. This is all the beginning of all the scandal. This yeah. is actually the Duke of Buckingham who built the house. He fought with the uh, Earl of Shrewsbury because he was having an affair with the wife. And in fact, he built um, uh, Cliveden as, as somewhere for them to, to meet. And he, he, bought, he built, he built, he built this place mistress. just for his mistress. <laughs> I think it was me. I'd be lucky if it was a bed set. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness me, the, the, bell is, the bells is, the, is ringing out. The bells are tolling and it's time for lunch. Do you feel peckish? I certainly do. Get me my arm, please. <laughs> and when it comes to food, Cliveden, with its two top-class restaurants and private dining rooms, offers the best there is. And the man in charge is head chef Ron Maxfield. Well, I'm going to do a salad of uh, ripe plum tomatoes with chagrilled uh, red mullet with spiced chorizo sausage on the top. Very light dish for yeah. sort of al fresco weather, nice summery weather, sitting by the garden, by the pool within Cliveden, having a nice light lunch. But first, you'll need to make a saffron rouet. And for this simple but very classy sauce, you mix the yolk of an egg with four heaped tablespoons of warm mashed potato, a teaspoon of crushed garlic, a generous pinch of saffron, and three tablespoons of olive oil. If it gets too thick, like mayonnaise, just add a little bit of water to it to thin it down. Yeah. The second stage of this delicious dish is to well season two fillets of red mullet and then place thinly sliced chorizo sausage on top. Cook for a few minutes. While it's being grilled, Ron pours the saffron rue into the middle of a circle of peeled sliced plum tomatoes. Place the fish on top, lovingly adorn with a salad of your choice and finish off with a dressing of pesto sauce. So with good food and convivial company, what more can a man ask? Mm. You see, Jen, I've always fancied you. Over the years, you, you, you're just the only thing that's really kept me going. But we met before. We did. Not and many... you didn't propose or anything. Yeah, I know. Sorry. <laughs> I missed out, all right? And now your husband's got Cliveden and I've got my bed set. That's all right. Know which side my bread's buttered. 